my lunch break, I'm about to get ready and go to the basement to do my last minute preparing for the Atlanta Women Expo this weekend. Friday, they do allow you to set up before the event. Um, so that's why I'm going in there. I pretty much have everything done. It's just a few more um, foaming sugar scrubs that I need to make. And then also I need to wrap the flowers for my flower diffuser. So I am about to go to the basement to do that. I may insert some clips. I'm not sure because I am rushing being that I am on my hour break, um, but it doesn't take me that long to make foam and sugar scrubs because I only have a few, literally a few that I need to make because everything else is ready. So I'm about to get ready to go to the basement to do that. I may insert some clips if I can, if not, I'm sorry, but definitely taking you guys along this journey with me um, at the Atlanta Women Expo. This is my first entrepreneurship um, video where you guys get to see a little behind the scenes of what I do for my business. If you are not aware, I do have a candle bath and body business. It is called Another Shade of Light. Um, so I'm about to get ready to go do that and take you guys along the journey with me this weekend. Got this shit about the mud still grinding like I'm trying to get my weight up. When it gave too many chances to you niggas, I can't let nobody play us. Yeah, I got in my back when I looked up, ain't seen them but a bunch of haters. No matter how much money we went through, we never let the paper change us. Uh, I done ran it up out the mud, I get paid to pop out of clubs. Put my pride in them in my budget, I watch people change, can't trust them. I got rich, but I'm still hustling, all my full speed of that cash. I can feel the shit in my cab muscles reminiscing back when I ain't had none. Now they acting like they all happy for me. What was you at when I needed? it? When it come to money, I'm greedy. I take anything just to please you. You can take everything if you leave it. Ain't trying to say you're perfect, but I'm decent. I ain't going back broke for no reason. My drip and my leave a puddle. If I need it, clean it up. I'ma quit the pick her up the fruit. Just put it on the floor. That other shit I'm not for. Damn, my dog, and he know what I like. He done found me plenty in my life. Problem is, I meet a girl tonight. Then I go and treat her too nice. Galleria credit card swipes. I don't even know if she a wife. But I do know one thing, though. Women, they come, they go. Saturday through Sunday, Monday. Monday through Sunday, yo. Maybe I'll love you one day. Maybe we'll someday grow. Till then, I'll sit my drunk ass on that runway on this one way. Baby, won't you meet me by the beam? Too early, baby, later you could show me things You know what it is whenever I visit Windy City, she blowing me kisses, no 30 degrees, way too close, so hold me tight Will I see you at the show tonight? Will I see you at the show tonight? Jury in the safe on arrival, pistol on J for survival. A lot of people gunning for the title, a lot of people trying to take us viral. I'm just trying to have a nice night, the waiter brought a check for the meal. She said, babe, I think that was a typo. Nah, girl, I got it, that's life, though. I can show you bigger things than that. It's gonna be a minute till I'm back. Let me get your images that last. Amex had a limit in the past. I had plenty women in the past. I done plenty sinning in the past. Y'all don't need to know, but you can ask. Sticking on your backstage pass All access cause you bad You could go wherever with that ass Show to the shower, to the truck Truck to the club for the party You go in first with your girls Cause I don't know who's out there watching But I do know one thing though Women, they come, they go Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday, Sunday, yo Maybe I'll love you one day Maybe we'll someday grow Till then I'll sit my drunk ass on that runway On this one way 2.30, baby, won't you meet me by the beam? Too early, baby, later, you can show me things You know what it is whenever I visit Windy City, she blowing me kisses, no 30 degrees, way too low, so hold me tight So I am currently just parked About to go meet some friends at Southern Gentlemen um, 
long day. Did the Atlanta Women Expo. Have to go back tomorrow. Um, it is Saturday and Sunday event. But when I tell you I'm drained, drained. Almost did not meet my friends. Um, but this meeting was important. Um, and so when your friends need you, you show up. And so I'm here. So I'll see y'all in a minute. All right. So this is real weird. You have to go. Hello. Where 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 do I go off for southern gentlemen? Right okay. Thank you. I hate walking through stairways. It's weird. And when I tell y'all, hella stairs, I'll fuck it up. So you gotta walk past and through a whole nother restaurant. crazy is I'm always the last person and I'm the first person uh-uh I don't like that I'm coming I don't like that good how are you thank you I want to sit up over here so I can see what's going on Okay, so how cool is this? If there is a green light, that means that there is a park. So that's the green light and it's next to this parking spot. And all the rest of them means there is no park. How cool is that? All right, y'all. Day two, I am on my way in. I'm tired. Um, I know y'all seen after the event, I went to 
I went actually out to eat with some friends. I wanted to go home, but it was requested. It's real empty in here. Came early to prepare, of course, but it's the last day. Hopefully I get some recordings. It'd be like real busy. So I don't know if I recorded that much, but I'll see what I can get today. Hey y'all, so really quickly, I wanna talk about last night. So after I left the um, Southern Gentleman restaurant, um, I was on the freeway coming back home, I wanna say about 10.30. I am in the second to fast lane. So really quick, before I get into that, I've always known about road rage. I've, I've seen it a few times on the streets or the freeway as far as like, you know, people going real fast and getting on people's, the back of their car or like, um, trying to stop somebody from getting over, jumping in front of you, honking a horn. I've seen people cursing people out, all kinds of stuff. But yesterday, 
it was way more serious. Um, and it's just not, it's just not that serious. Your life is way more serious. I don't understand the people that is super extra on the road. So I'm on the freeway, like I said, about 1030 last night, and I am in the second to fast lane. There is this white car and this black car. The white car was in front of the black car. They are inside of the, in the fast lane. I'm in the, the lane next to them, but they are like in front of me. And so the white car is in the front. The black car speeds up and literally is like bumper to bumper with the white car, right? But the white car, he like sped up. Uh, I'm assuming he's thinking like maybe this guy is going to get over or something like that. And so black car did not. He sped up and he's on this guy's butt. And so white car, he like slows down again, but like slams on his brake a little bit. And so the black car like almost hit him. And so he was mad. Now, again, it's 1030 at night. Not that many people on the freeway. He could have literally got over again. I'm behind them. So he could have got in front of me, sped past the white car and then got back in front of him. But no, that's not what he wanted to do. He wanted to be extra. So do you know this man gets in front of me to go past the white car and shoots at the white car five times? When I tell y'all I was so terrified, I was scared as hell. I'm not knowing. All I know is that I hear gunshots. I don't know where he's shooting. Obviously, he's shooting at the white car, right? But the bullet could have came back to me. Anything could have happened. And so I'm terrified and I'm thinking to myself, like, is it really that serious to get past somebody or be mad that you are speeding and you are on their butt? Like, how are you going to get that man and start shooting at somebody's car? He could have shot the man. The man car could have spin out and then he would have hit my car because they were only like two to three cars in front of me. Really, I'll say they were only about two cars in front of me. And so... Like, y'all, when I tell you I got home last night, heart was beating so fast. Um, Mind you, I'm already sleepy because it was a super long day at the Atlanta Women Expo. Right after that, going out with my friends. Um, And y'all, that was so scary. Road rage is real. It's not that serious, you guys. If somebody is getting over, if somebody is like speeding behind you, and don't don't slow down just get out that way because people is ignorant your life is way more serious it is not that serious to be playing games with people some people want to race you some people just want to do stupid stuff and thank god he didn't hit the guy I'm, i'm 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 going to pray that he didn't hit the guy now i know that the white car slowed down and allowed the black car to get in front of him but he like slowed all the way down y'all to where he was he got over in front of me. Um, well, I already ended up getting all the way over, y'all. I'm, at this point, I am in the emergency line and emergency lane, and I rode that all the way home because I was only like three exits from my house. When I tell y'all I rode the emergency lane, I don't want to be in nobody way. You hear me? Nobody way. And so he slowed all the way down. I'm, I hope that he was not hit. I'm sure he was terrified as well, which is why he probably slowed all the way down and just let that car get out the way. But a moral to the story is life is way more serious, way more precious. If someone is driving crazy, let them, y'all. Don't try to uh, match their energy. Get out these people away. I just wanted to come on here and say that before I end out this video. Y'all be safe out here.